Parents concerned after Burgess High School was put on lockdown earlier today due to a bomb threat. That is according to the officials with the El Paso Independent School District. The school is located at the 7800 block of Edgemere Boulevard. That's in East El Paso. Students were later relocated to a nearby school, MacArthur Elementary. That is where we find ABC 7's Brianna Pettis with the latest details. Brianna. That's right. As you can see, the scene is now back to normal. But earlier today, I did speak with some parents who told me they rushed to come pick up their kids and are now relieved to have them back safe. Now, the kids were placed in the field of McCarthy Elementary School as they were waiting to get picked up. They were later moved inside of the school in that cafeteria. In a statement released moments ago by EPISD officials, they say the evacuation was a precautionary measure. They said students were returned to their school at around 2.30 p.m. That's when officials say the investigation into the potential threat against the campus was concluded. Some parents I spoke to say their kids were left rattled from the incident. No, she's scared. She's, uh, she's uh, terrified right now. Well, I got anxiety because um, the fear of not knowing and uh, what's happening, you know, what's going on and why this happened. Uh, so the uncertainty of not knowing is, is, is my feeling right now. That's right. And the district did not specify if anything was found, but coming up on ABC 7 at 6, some parents say that school threats are becoming too common. For now reporting in East El Paso, Brianna Perez, ABC 7. All right, Brianna, thank you.